Maybe you're not as angry as the celebrities we're about to fill you in on. Why would they be angry? Zaleb's is back. Oh yes, Mini La Mini talks butts on Jacaranda FM for the Big Butts competition. And Brennan Oli takes a stand against well, we don't know exactly. <laughs> and Unati takes on Twitter as she lashes out and swears at a fan. This is thelibs.com. Sit tight, you're gonna wanna hear this. Oh, yeah. Mini Lamini was recently on the complimentary breakfast show on Jacaranda FM to talk about, um, butts. That's right. Mini was trusted with the tiresome and probably mentally disturbing job of curating images of Jacaranda FM listeners' butts. A whopping 10,000 rand was awarded to the best booty, judged by not so mini booty herself. You know how the song goes, Sia. Yeah? We don't want none unless you got bums, huh? To see Mini's commentary on the people's bums, be sure to visit our site for the full article. Yo, Sia, yeah. Brenda Ngoli is fed up. With what? I am not sure exactly, but she went off on Twitter about how she gets mistreated as an artist. Brenda released a series of tweets where she is obviously upset at the perspective some people adopt towards artists. One of her tweets read, Hey, she pulled out all her corsa and was like, Aye, aye, I'm about to name and shame. Zekin Jen Dive Okanye Dibone article Andy Cholaya. And then they laugh and say artists die poor. Mm, we wonder, son. After making controversial statements about racism at Stellenbosch University, Unati Msingana snapped back at Twitterville following her trending hashtag Unati Be Like. Perhaps a little too hard, actually. So hard, in fact, that Unati actually slid in the DMs of one of her fans and gave them a mouthful after the fan used the hashtag condescendingly, calling the fan a psychotic biatch, along with many other words we can't say on TV. It seems no one is safe on the screen grab nowadays, huh? Mm, maybe she needs the wooden mic award? Ouch. He liked it, so he put a ring on it. <laughs> it's interesting because I have different names in different places. So in Lesotho where I grew up, everyone calls me Fiki. Then I moved to Cape Town at UCT, they called me Fix. All of a sudden it's like, hey Fix. What are you, are you talking to me? Like, you know. <laughs> And then I moved to Job and Fixie kind of happened also because my Instagram handle is Fixie. So yeah, it's between Fix and Fixie. We'd love to know what you guys think of Brenda Ngoli's standpoint and what you make of Unati's potty mouth. So do make sure to tweet us at Zalibs. And if you're watching on YouTube, scroll down to the comment section and leave us your thoughts on all of today's stories. Don't forget that you can click on the bottom right corner of the video on YouTube to subscribe to our channel. And for the full stories, go to Zalibs.com. If you don't, Will not he be like?